Good morning, children. So me and Roy are just in the big shed. It is horrendous weather, really, really bad weather. And we are going to lift this panel out. Now, although it's annoying that it sticks over the edge, this is the issue. So that there's a thousand mil and that there's 900 and it's absolutely destroying Roy that it sticks. You can't even see, it's not that bad. He doesn't need to do this. There, it sticks out, can you see? So he wants it lifting out and another one putting in. Now you know what I've got to live with. So they're from a different company. Yeah, go on. They're from a different concrete company completely. We could have washed it off, but we just wanted to see if it'd fit. So get the hooks on and lift it out. Yeah, definitely. Go forward. Go on. So this here is a little bank of cubicles. Well, it will be a little bank of cubicles, just not quite yet. So the other panel that fit that we want in here has actually got um, different lifting eyes on. So we had to wait for Dean to come back to, because the lifting eyes, these ones here were here, but the other lifting eyes were locked in the mini digger. So I'll leave you here and you can watch the carnage. So, we're just making sure that we can get to them. Can you see the screwy eye things? They let them attack. It's close, guys. Right? It's close to whether or not we're going to be able to do it. Um, <clears throat> FYI. So, uh, lamb cam that I've been showing you all the time every night is... Let me, let me get over here, then I can show you. Anywho, these are the cameras that I use. This one here, uh, it was called Livestock Eye. They actually went bankrupt and disappeared and the cameras all stopped working or something along those lines. Crazy. Can't get it to work at all. Um, I've had it for two years. I was really pleased with it when I used it. Um, but then I went to plug it in this year and absolutely not a jiffy. It just, it barely even moves. It just kind of faces at the floor. And yeah, I, I don't know what happened because obviously it's right up there and nothing can have gone wrong with it because no one's touched it. So as you can see, I've had the top off it, taken all the SIM cards out and stuff. And we've transferred over to Farm Stream. There you go. Honestly, I, I've... <laughs> I've forgotten to say it, although I should have done. They sent me that camera and I'd had it in the kitchen, sat around for ages. And obviously when the robots come, when the robots are put in and the jerseys come, we'll be using it all the time. But as it stood, we've only really used cameras for lambing and calving. Well, obviously there's no calving this year because we've not got any cows. They've all gone. Um, and lambing is obviously the only time we we're going to use it. So I plugged it in, just hoping to use it like the same way that I used that one. Oh my God, it's so good. Oh, really, really good. You can zoom in. You can zoom in on an ear tag if you so wanted to. Honestly, I really rate it. It's going to be absolutely amazing. So I'm going to get a couple of them, not just one. But for lambing, it's made life really bloody easy. Um, we did use a camera anyway, so it wasn't a, you know, a revelation to me. But the quality of it, um, it is pretty good. So everything you've been watching on lamb cam is that black camera there. And it's a company called Farm Stream. Now, they are actually really reasonably priced, so I'll be buying a few more of them to put around the Jersey Shed just so we can keep an eye. And then, obviously, at some point, we will need um, cameras in. I might even leave that one in here because this is a carving shed. And then get another couple to go in above the robots. But, yeah, um, just wanted to give them a shout-out. I know I don't do shout-outs very often, but, yeah, shout-out. They sent me the camera. I am actually really impressed with it. Um, it came at a time when my camera had itself broken. So it was one of those very rare instances when it was like a gifted collaboration that was bloody handy and the, the gifty actually really wanted it. So yeah, top notch, would 100% recommend and I will be buying more of them. 
So I suppose that tells you what you need to know. I will be buying some because they are that good. And honestly, you can literally zoom in on an ear tag. If a cow was in it, you'd be able to zoom in on the ear tag. But yeah, I've been zooming on sheep's foof foofs um, to check lambing. And it's been really, really handy. Really, really good. Night vision's spot on. Really impressed. To the sheep, everyone, look. <laughs> Love them, Roy. Sage can escape. Get on. The pregnant ladies have stayed and escaped. A. Eh? They were foiled at the last moment. I've just spat a rubber ring out my mouth. Go on. Whoosh. No. Whoosh. Get on! Go on! The ladies have staged an escapade. An escapade on Roy. Roy was watching the gate. Wasn't me. It was not me. Down, lie down, lie down, don't go near them. Lie down. Lie down. Good boy. Lie down! Don't. Lie down. I just want them to move. I don't want them terrified. Lie down. Stand. Stand. Ah, 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 ah. Stand. 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 Steady. 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 Right. That'll do. Win. 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 Here. 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 Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. On easier on my own. Just saying. I'm just saying. That he's going to sit and watch this. Just saying, got this lamb here, it's knuckled. I've just turned it out, it's just been on his ass in that trailer, but I've just turned it out. And look, it's just got snuckles. I think I'm gonna just stick some wrap it up, I think, just for now. No, 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 sweetie, turn around, your mum's over there, turn around. You are a little lamb. I'm gonna. Oh, it's cross at me. Oh, so we've just got some little splints and we're just gonna knuckles. Oh, we're focusing on a piece of straw, not the lamb. And um, knuckles' his legs are gonna get splinted like this straight. They're just pieces of plastic from kids' stuff. Um, so I'll do that. I'll go. Show us what you've got. Hey, <sighs> when I woke up today, that I'd have lambs with pink shoes. of the ladies again. We found doing this has really helped ladies this year. Normally when you stick them in a shed together in a bit of a foisty environment, they get quite a bit of lameness. Not had any issues at all this time. And I think that just is just keeping it mucked out at the front where they're eating and licking the licks. I think as well, it's also kept their bed, the actual beds a lot cleaner and drier because they're panching at the front. Um, very handy, very, very handy. Like, I don't know what I am gonna do come carving Jersey cows in here because um, I'm not gonna wanna give it back for lambing. Wow, that is a wreck speeder, I must say. It's not the best. Works though. So we're very quickly just gonna have a little go at sticking some panels in.
Oh, so we need your help. Right, you go and stand next to it. These are 600 panels. Do you think they're too tall for jerseys? Like, we wanted 500, but all the builders said, go for six. Like, for, yeah, so 500's like here. Do you think that's too tall? Sausage in a pen. Hi, little sausage. And um, from the looks of things, we've got another black one and another white one. Does that mean, so does that mean that if she would have been topped by one top, she would have only had a single? Like, why are none of them throwing triplets? They're only throwing singles. So they're throwing one of each. Yeah. That's crazy. Honestly, the whole thing, I find it so fascinating. Do you think it's been with a belt at Oh no, what is that? What is that? Lady, what is that? That is a... Oh, it's down, lady. Get down. The fuck is something not good? Oh, I think it's been dead a bit, whatever it is. Tiny. Oh no. Ooh. Doesn't smell funny. She looks peaky this morning. Come on out of there, you. Are you dead, dead? <laughs> Bless her, she wants it as well. What a shame. Um, she's actually having twins, so I'm going to throw her in a pen and just have a see what else is in her. Anything could have happened. She could have been a bit under the weather. She could have been knocked by another sheep. It is just one of those things. Um, she, before when I was walking round with Roy, I said, She's looking really skinny. I wouldn't be surprised if she's not absorbed her lambs and she's not, like, she's not actually having one. And then, lo and behold, that happens. It's funny when you notice something, isn't it? I'm just going to go and grab a big glove because I think everything the other one will be probably arm deep. It's been dead long, though. Um, the actual lamb itself didn't smell funny. Just the placenta was really dark, um, which obviously means it's died and come away from the, like, the lining a little bit sooner. Looking really peaky, so I'll take her an injection as well. So I've got her in a pen. I had to run around after a like. There's another sheep lambing over there. Um, so I'll just stick some gloves on. Cause she's passing more uh, stuff, you know. I did. I can't believe it. I can't, be I just can't believe that that's alive. Oh, it's got literally no muscle on it whatsoever. Can you see its spine there? Oh, it's it came out kicking. I've just went to walk away and there's another one. There's another one. Um, I did not know that. She's marked down as twins. Um, so let's see if we can be um, third time lucky. Look at that. It's just not even taking any pull in at all. Um, be very, very gentle because obviously it's got tiny little legs. Oh God, that's so, oh, that's small. Oh, that's, oh, that's small, that's small. That's, would you believe? I am um, bless her over there she's been on the same length this time as her so I'm just going to get her in and have a look she's just started so we'll leave her be let her just do her own thing see what she's like when we've strawed and limed everywhere just just see what she's like well I'm in this shape because she's useless and would you believe it's another white one <laughs> look at him <laughs> Sisters from another mister. Phenomenon is absolutely slaying me. Honest to God, it is the best thing ever. Tiny baby lamb has gone walk about right through the barrier, just like a slithery little snake, right into a big <coughs> pile of fresh lime. Nice. Come on. Well, that didn't take any doing, did it? Jeez. Go on back in there, eh? Well, you can walk, clearly. <laughs> oh, jeez, look at this. That thing's not sus, is it? Behaviour of this. That is just not plum. I'm thinking something terrible's going on there. They are normally flighty as hell and won't let you get near them and all of a sudden this thing's just lethargic and lies about. There's something not quite right, so I've penned her up completely on her own. 
just to see what the crack is, but I'm reckoning there's something not good. And I'm just being cynical and she's just in the early stages of labour. We went to town for tea and then bear in mind we had nothing last night and nothing this morning. And then all of a sudden, one, two, three, four pop out in the space of half an hour. This is crazy. Right next to each other. Would you believe? What's that Michael Jackson song? Oh, she's just had another now. She just spat one out. Is it moving? Oh, we are moving. Oh, we look very dramatic down there. Hello. Hello, Susan. God, they're bold, aren't they? They're mightly funny. They've been got by that Beltex. Little bold things. Aren't they ugly? Ah, oh, them. Right, queer mess. Oh, look at that. Importantly, I just want to check if you've got milk. Oh, I've got little titties. Let me look. Don't kick anything, please. Oh, there. Good girl. Oh, wait. I think we do. Oh. Nice yellow cloth from there. Not too thick. They'll be able to suck that out. Can't get over the size of this dog. I'll put you on. Shall I put you on then? I know you had a good drink. <laughs> so I'm a little bit sus of this mule. So I had a bit of a touchy feel. Well, it was coming ass first, wasn't it? No wonder she couldn't push it out. No wonder she looked sad. So let's give it a go. Just the craziest night ever. Crazy. Black and white, black and white. Some little baldies, some miniature miniatures, like the miniaturest miniatures I've ever seen. And then two absolutely colossal mules. I can't wait to put them two together because that would just be absolutely hilarious. Oh, I need a heat lamp over there above that very tiny lamp. I also need my camera back. Um, the extension cable was borrowed today by the builders. So what I'm gonna do is something slightly, uh, I'm gonna see if it'll stretch all the way across here. It might, it might not, let's let's see, let's see. Um, cheaper only small, it's not like they're a cow that's gonna you know, jump up and chew it down with the tongue. So yeah, let's have a look. to refill my pockets allow me to refill my pockets is hobbit this is um right this injection was for that sheep it's a good job i emptied my pockets is because i forgot that it was for her i have two things for the tiny lamb i have the heat lamp that i've just brought over and moved everything electricity wise over this side of the building so i can still have a camera and a heat lamp and i've also got um a leg warmer which i'm very fond of for going inside my wellies um, but they are just off Amazon for pence. So I'm going to cut holes in this and the lamb can wear it as a tiny jacket to keep it warm because it has no fat. For one minute, right, is this going to work or is a sock better suited to you? Bloody socks better. Well, maybe not. Stuff. Put your head in the blanket.
I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Um, I'm hoping that sheep doesn't um, think that that's somebody else's lamb. No, she seems to be. Yeah, she seems to be fine. I'll keep an eye on the cameras right above her. Sorry, I just can't. I can't, I'm just, I can't.